So I'm making this recording to uh, show you how to deal with um, a particular problem that some people are having making their first um, commit and, uh, and push. So I have checked out a copy of um, December 13, um, the ES6 template code. So this would be the, the newer template code, but um, the same principles uh, should apply. So you can see I've got two, um, two changes here. So I've changed this um, contact on MD here, and I changed the contact on HTML because um, I'm running <coughs> npm start, and it's generated the um, contact page from the contact um, MD and the contact JS. So what I want to do is I'm going to stage these changes, and uh, I'm going to say um, added or add to contact page. Now commit. Oh, and um, I've got trouble. So it says um, in my computer, it says make sure you configure your user.name and user.email in Git. Okay, so just gonna click cancel. So it won't let it won't actually let me commit now um, because I don't have a username or, or email configured in Git. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to terminal. I'm gonna open a new terminal. I'm gonna type in git config minus minus global. User dot name H Hildred and I'm gonna do git config minus minus global user dot email R Hildred W-L-U dot C-A. Okay. And that should be it. That should be all I need to um, <coughs> use Git. So I'm going to click exit here. I'm going to click this check mark. And sure enough, that is all I need to um, configure to use Git. So now I can um, push these um, commits. And um, I think it's just going to do it. Looks like it did just do it. Okay, so that should be all you need to do. Just uh, open a terminal window. Run git config minus minus global user dot email. Rhelter at wlu dot ca. Only you need to put your own email address in, of course. And get config minus minus global user dot name rich hildred. Only again, of course, you need to put in your own um, name. 